coming to you from the heat dome, not the thunder dome, the heat dome. Um, we are getting my son a slushy from the gas station. He's got a really bad sore throat and we, my husband and I are going to go run to Goodwill and to the health food store and then go back home. I just thought I'd bring you guys along uh, for a little day in the life. He's dropping some stuff off at Goodwill. And then we're gonna go in and see if they've got some clothes for my oldest. He had like, my glasses look so funny. He had like a major growth spurt. He's grown, gosh, four to five inches. He's tall. And my stomach is just rolling. It's not really rolling. It feels like I've got lead in my stomach right now. Uh, and hormones catch my drift. So it's gonna be fun. Uh, Flushing machine was down at the gas station, so we're gonna try um, another one after we get done here. Hit up the health food store and go home because it's freaking hot, and I don't deal with it. Don't take or anything. But anyway, I hope you guys are doing great and enjoy today's a day in the life. I know I sound so enthusiastic, but I'm I'm seriously melting in the AC. It's got an owl on it and uh, it opens up. I don't know why, but I love that. I love it. And they got all these dresses. And here we are to look for my son's gold vest. And this has so much like texture on it. And then there's this one. I really like this little dress shirt. It's old navy, but it won't fit any of my kids. Do you think this would fit D? It's 10-12. And got some fun Christmas jammies. Mm. This would have been good for the heat wave. Shoes and toys. Oh my gosh, they have Chewbacca. You're coming home with me. I have blankets. I need some fall. Ooh, they got a couch. A red couch. I wonder if they have blankets because I need some fall blankets and looking for budget friendly because the broke this is kind of fallish nah ooh this is fallish but would that look okay on my couch I don't know my dog might eat that it might be a bad idea but that would I really like that hmm Here's this, that one's cute. Makes you think of Blue's Clues. Cute. Got a lot of men's suit jackets. Aw, oh, Mickey, Pluto. My friend Amanda would like that. Mickey Mouse. Um, oh, what's your stuff? Never mind. I love this. That's so cute. Just a nice brown blanket. That's good and heavy. I like this one. This is really nice. Let's see. It's 
99 cents. I think I'm gonna get this one. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna get this one. All these books. <gasps> Hooked on phonics. You don't know I'm looking with you everything is complete. Do you know how much I love you? I put your favorite song on just to wake you up. When I dance around, I can't help but feeling just loving this moment. Can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment. Can we stay here together? If I could stop the time, don't you know that? Okay, see nothing, my glasses are fogged over. Can you pull the lever for me? Oh. That's good. store. I like it because there's nobody here. There's like three other shoppers in the whole store. What we get so far, dear? Got some pepper steak. What else? Three of these. So, bonus I want sirloin. some steak. I need a snack. So, man, another stop at my husband's old job to get some fish but at the health food store he got this fire cider it's a uh, apple cider vinegar wellness tonic with the mother in wildflower honey uh, there's 16 shots in here it's like 15 dollars it's got live raw vinegar and raw honey um, oranges lemons onions ginger horseradish garlic turmeric habanero pepper black pepper and a certified organic ingredient whatever that means but anyway this is like um, we, don't, we don't we don't do elderberry he really likes his fire cider vinegar to stay healthy and then he got put on the waiting list for Celtic sea salt because she said it's a real hot commodity right now and I, I blame TikTok for that because if y'all don't watch Barbara O'Neill you should definitely look her up she is a genius with like natural wellness stuff um, anyway so we're on the wait list for that and uh, yeah so I got my Mountain Dew slush and I made quite a mess of it at the gas station, like a two-year-old. But, it is now, it's only 91 degrees, but it feels like 100. And I think the actual tip is supposed to be over 100 today. So again, if you're out in the heat wave, don't be like me, drink caffeine and dehydrate yourself. Hydrate yourself with water. And he has just, He's been out of school for three days now. I don't know how we're gonna do this because they only get 10 sick days from school. Five of those are doctor's excuses. My ring's too big. And then five are mommy days. He's already used two mommy days, one, two, three doctor's excuse days. And it's not even through the first month of school. But it's not his fault, he's, he's sick. He's got an upper respiratory infection. Um, we kept him home today because his throat's just really sore and he's just, not feeling good. He, does, he hasn't had a fever for 24 hours, so hopefully he's better to go by Monday so we can get caught up on all that schoolwork and he feels better and all that jazz. Um, my husband's probably talking and taking forever. That's cool. I'm gonna stop talking now and the next clip will be, um, I'll show you what all we got at Goodwill. Oh, and I did my nails yesterday. I 
at the gorge. I don't know. I was at my mom's and I said, I wish I'd remember to bring my nail polish because they look so janky. And she's like, well, I don't have the colors you do, but here's what I have. And I love this color, especially for fall. What do you think? These are my real nails. I can't afford to go anywhere fancy and do anything. And that's okay. I think girls that can do that, their nails are so gorgeous, but I just settle for this. <laughs> and here's my other hand. And that's okay. Anyway, I'll show you guys the haul when we get I lied. We just got home, but I thought I would traipse through the garden for just a second. Oh, there's a giant hole. Hope I don't get eaten by an anaconda. Um, okay, so let me show you my loofah. All right, so this one is actually starting to brown. Um, just a little bit more and it'll be time to pick it. I'm so excited. And then I don't know if I've showed y'all yet, but we have been seeing a lot of growth. So here's another one. And then um, I have to take a little dip under here take you guys into my wonderland of zucchini, not zucchini, oh my heavens, my loofah. <laughs> kind of looks like corn. I really, oh, and that's a cucumber, but how gorgeous is my little loofah tunnel? Like, I still can't believe I've never heard of this until I was randomly looking at seed packets and saw loofah, and I was like, oh, I want to plant that. And here's another one. I mean, look at the size of them honkers. I'm going to feel weird if y'all call honkers something else. Like, I know some people call boobs honkers. <laughs> look at the size of them honkers. Anyway, here's another one. It's huge. I told my mama, I said, you know, for Christmas this year, I think I know what everybody's going to get. Loofahs and body washes. I'm going to give everybody loofah scrubs. Whew, duck under. Okay, and now, um, behind me is a cucumber tunnel. Rip, you scared me to death. I'm sneaking up behind me and about knocked me over. Hey, but oh, just for the camera. Thank you for that. Okay, this is where we planted our pumpkins. And so far, it looks like we have some kind of worm eating. Yeah, I see them now. They're on top of those leaves, so we have to do something about that. Um, but anyway, this is our pumpkin, so hopefully we have a bountiful harvest of pumpkins. We still got our banana peppers growing strong and we have no more beans, squash, okra, broccoli. It's all just mowed down and our tomatoes were a fail this year. I guess I'm done outside. Something else, I don't know if I ever told you guys, but I really wanted to plant a butterfly garden and I didn't do it this year. So I really hope I get the opportunity to do that next year. Um, um, that shed is my husband's paint shed. He paints as a side hustle and it's gonna be moving down that way towards the chicken coop this Sunday. So I'll have this empty spot to, um, I could put my butterfly garden there or maybe by this tree, I don't know. But it's something that I've been planning forever and I just didn't do it. I'm so mad at myself. But anyway, we're gonna head inside now and show you what we got at, um, at Goodwill. Um, Goodwill and the grocery store. So, from the grocery store, we picked up some of these Luden's Wild Cherry Cough Drops. Y'all remember when they sold these in the little boxes and they were like 50 cents? Those are the good old days. And then I picked up two of these Tony's pizzas. We got pepperoni and a cheese one. Um, and then my husband wanted pepper steaks. So it's steak with pepper on it. I've never had it. Um, I can't eat pepper, so, but. So we got that, and then I got three of these because I have just been really wanting some steak. And it was cheaper to get them like this than in a big pack. Nope, this is not what I wanted. Dead gummit. But this will be like eight meals for me because I'll cut these in half, and that last one was huge. Yeah, that'll definitely, that'll make four steaks right there for me. And then five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, so that'll make eight meals. I thought they were all 365, so I just grabbed three thinking it was all like this. But, um, oops, that one's 629. And then I looked at the price of pork chops. I can't believe how cheap pork is. It really stinks that I can't eat it. Um, and then we went and picked up some fresh cod. I'm trying to get some fish in my diet. 
thing was I grabbed this 24 pack of Ozarka water. This was like $6.79, which was a lot, but I'm getting really nauseated now drinking water. So I'm trying to find one that doesn't make me want to barf. So this is what we found, Ozarka. So we'll see how that works. Okay, I'm waving. No, I'll take my hat off. It's just so hot and my tripod and my, whew, it's hot. And my tripod is just broken. So I'll just go through and show you what we picked up at Goodwill uh, for my son. So they basically had a bunch of red stuff. So this is a Red Hawk. He got this Red Hawks shirt. Hunter, is this yours? It's huge. What is it? The Red Hawks t-shirt? Yeah. Okay. So we got a Red Hawks t-shirt. And then he got um, this Fila red. I mean, y'all look, this swallows me. My child is huge. He's so tall. Okay, this nice Adidas red shirt with the black stripe. It's like the athletic material. And then uh, he got some jeans. These are Cat and Jack. I picked these up. I thought these were super cute and stylish. They've got the distressed and them and i'm not sure if somebody just wore them out and thought there's holes in them let's get rid of them or if this is how they were made but i mean they were like four dollars so and they're kind of stretchy i just thought they were so cute and then he got some arizona advanced flex 360 jeans and the size 18 yes because they're slim fit so we figured you know 18 i did the whole thing where you put the jeans on their back on their waist and see if it fits and these did great so hopefully those work out as well and then i randomly saw these hanging on an end cap and i grabbed them they're just some gray leggings like athletic they are america america sport i don't know it's really scratched out but they're stretchy they're large and they're gray. So now I have a new color of legging to wear and they were like three or $4. And then y'all saw I picked up this really nice blanket and yes, it has the fringe on the end, but it's not torn up looking like that maroon one was. And this is like a heavy blanket throw and it's not um, that real hot. This will be good on the couch for fall. And it was 99 cents, so I'm excited about it. And then the most random thing, y'all saw me grab this Chewbacca. My son loves plushies, okay? And we just got rid of a bunch of stuff so I can get him this one. I think it's so fun, it's Chewbacca. And then for my youngest son, we got him Pete the Cat. Cause you can't go wrong with Pete the Cat. Like, isn't he so cute? He's even got the little paw. And these were 99 cents. So you, you really can't beat that. Anyway, that's what I got at Goodwill. And um, I think I'm going to end the, the vlog here because I'm just going to be cleaning, filming my weekly reset. So come back Monday for that. And uh, to be honest, I'm in a really weird mood today. And I don't want to... I don't want to sound like I have an attitude, but I kind of do. And I just, oh, little owl. Isn't he so cute? My seven-year-old made that at school and I'm just obsessed with it. I love owls. Anyway, this is what I got to clean up. Got to put all this stuff away, wash it, put the food away. And um, you'll see all that in Monday's video. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Be grateful, good grace, God bless. Bye.